Hey everyone, it's Alyssa from Planned Alyssa. I am here with this week's What I Sold on Etsy video. I'm going to apologize because I am in a patch of sun. I'm trying to get away from it and there's just like nowhere I can go to get away from it in this little office of mine. So um, yeah, I have like a weird lighted blob on me. But I'm here with this week's What I Sold on Etsy video and it has not been a, a very busy week so it's not going to be a very long video. The week started off really strong. I was selling a bunch of stuff and then it just came to a screeching halt. I don't know what happened. I, I'm guessing just, um, you know, I obviously sell other places too and seeing my sales this week, I feel like at least the beginning of the week things were busier. I think because people were doing like last minute Mother's Day shopping and not necessarily that the stuff they were buying were Mother's Day gifts, but you know, you're online, you're shopping, you might splurge and buy something for yourself as well as for mom. Um, that's my theory. I could be totally off on that, but that there did seem to be a trend as far as like Mother's Day stuff. Um, not necessarily Etsy. I think I sold one thing that somebody was buying as a gift and everything else, um, you know, is probably personal things. But I did see stuff selling um, on Amazon and, you know, I did the t-shirts and had, you know, my big seller of the week was a, a mom themed one, I guess. So. Um, anyway, I sold just six items this week on Etsy. Total is $105.50. So again, fell very far short of my $200 goal. Just over halfway there. I have been getting some stuff listed. We did have, well we have sun today, but we did have some good weather this week that was good for picture taking. So I got a bunch of pictures taken and have been getting some stuff listed on Etsy. But um not seeing the sales pick up just yet. We'll see how it goes next week. But in the meantime, I will show you the six different items that I sold and how much they sold for. As always, keep in mind the price is just the selling price and does not include the fees I paid to Etsy for to purchase the item and doesn't include the fees the buyer pays to have the item shipped to them. But here are the six items I sold this week. First item I sold this week was this wooden doll case, doll carrying case. It sold for $35. I picked this up not too long ago at a thrift store and um, it, it's a cool design. It's It was white with blue trim and it has this cute cat illustration on it. Um, probably from like the maybe 1960s or so. And it's a it's a larger size doll box sized for not like a Barbie doll but something bigger like like an American Girl doll something that size. Sold some vintage sunglasses for fifteen dollars. These were men's non prescription tinted lenses glasses sunglasses. Solar Meat was the brand on them, so not like a really high end pair of glasses and very lightly tinted. Um, almost almost clear really just a very light gray tint to the glasses I think I picked these ones up at a rummage sale sold a vase um, this was something that was in the clearance section of my shop so it sold for $8.50 I did have it priced I guess at $17 I marked them down 50% off on clearance this was something I picked up in a lot at an auction a while back um, is a box lot so you know, I was probably looking to get something else in the lot and this came with it. And um, anyway, I've had it for sale for a while, so I marked it down 50% off. And this is a vintage cross stitch kit uh, to make these different antique trains, locomotives. Sold for $25, a new unused kit, a larger sized kit. So, um, you know, that's why I priced it at $25. Might have priced a little less if it was smaller. I think I picked this kit up at a rummage sale. This was a small lot of sheet music. There were five different sheet music folders. It sold for $10. I think I picked these up in an auction lot as well. Again, it was probably something where, you know, I wanted something and it came with all this other stuff. And I had a few different lots, maybe like three different lots of sheet music. And I think this is the first one to sell. Um, so I probably have two more lots available. And finally this week I sold these two vintage puzzles. I had them listed as a set. 
Uh, they're both play school. They're wooden piece tray puzzles sold for $12. I picked these up at a thrift store. So like I said, that's it. Um, you know, I'm trying to get more stuff listed. I do have, you know, plenty of stuff right now, so that'll keep me busy for a while, and I might be going out to get some more stuff over the weekend. So, uh, yeah, just uh, keep on keeping on. That's what I'm doing here, hoping that things pick up soon, because this Etsy, it's been pretty slow for me. But uh, in the meantime, I hope your sales are doing well, and I'll see you all again soon. Happy selling, everyone!